Good evening and welcome back to another video. How are you all today on a Tuesday evening? The time around is 7.45 p.m. evening time in the beauty room. So yes, and it is August 2nd, 2022 on a beauty Tuesday. So happy Tuesday and beauty evening Tuesday. Make sure you grab yourself a snack, something to drink of your choice. Take notes if you like with pen and paper. It's totally up to you. And yes, if you're in your PJs or in your lounge dress like I am, this is from, what store did I get this from? I got this from like Forever 21 or Rainbow. It's one of those two stores. You know how they have like the tube, like the tube dresses, you know, that's where it really loose on the bottom. It's real long. You can wear it with, um, you can wear it with sandals, you know, or flip flops if you want and a cute, um, little, little shawl, um, if you want, or with a cute jean jacket that comes up to mid, mid halfway. So, you know, yeah, it looks cute with your hair down, but these earrings are also from, um, from Forever 21, from like two, three years ago. Um, yes, they were like three dollars on clearance. So yeah, check out your five below. I mean not five below. Check out your Forever Twenty One store for any jewelry, makeup brushes, or any makeup at all. And check out their cute clothing. Also check them out, I believe, online. And yes, this necklace is my mom's necklace, my engagement ring, and yeah, this and this headband is from 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 Sheen. Yes, for just a dollar. So I got this one. I got two of these, the same kind of the little animal print pink with the bow. And they have all kinds of colors on Shein. You can also check out Shein, not Shein, Shein. Check that out. You can also check out um, ChopCherry.com for their headbands too. And also check out um, Always May. It's A-L-W-A-Y-S. MEI.com for the cute spa headbands if you like as well. And yes, these products are also are all from Shop Miss A. This cute mirror is from Shop Miss A. And this is what this is. This is the AOA Studio Paw Paw. And this was like a dollar fifty-five. So your change will go to their charity for animal cruelty free. And everything else is in here is from Shop Miss A. It's between a dollar and like a dollar 88 and then the makeup brushes i'm going to be using in the in the middle of the video is ten dollars and 55 cents so definitely check out your shop miss a check out always may and check out um forever 21 and definitely check out um, shopcherry.com it's s-h-o-p-c-h-e-r-r-i-e.com for their spa headbands if you want to just have a nice growth in spa day at your home with you and your girlfriends, you know, your daughter, your niece, you know, and just have a nice spa day at home, you know, and you can definitely do, you know, you can get your feet done, you know, um, by a professional. If you know somebody that has their own like salon and they do traveling, you can definitely get your feet done by them if you trust that person, you know, and, you know, of course in your home or whichever. And yeah, so let's get into the video. Mom, let's do this. This is from Shop Miss A. All of the reviews and materials I'm using is from shopmiss8.com. Definitely make sure you check out Shop Miss A. It's very affordable for your wallet, for your coins. I do love me some Shop Miss A. I'm on there every other month or so looking at what they have new, what's new arrived, and putting it in my cart and getting it within a week or two or within a, couple, or a few days, you know like that so yeah but the first thing i did not do is my eyebrows i usually do my eyebrows off camera but i'm going to show you how i do my eyebrows with shop miss a products and this concealer is from aoa studio and this is their wonder cover hd concealer this is in espresso which is two three two four espresso by aoa shop miss a i love that so we're going to use that for my upper eyebrows and then my under eyebrows we're going to use a lighter concealer and then we're going to use this this is the wonder brow tinted brow pomade and this shade is in dark brown 
which is number 3025 dark brown and 3025 from their collection of AOA Studio. So we're going to use that. And this brush is number E115. I highly recommend that you use, or not, not highly, well not use it, but get it, I'm sorry. Highly recommend that you get this brush from Shop Miss A. It's a flat um, brush for your eyes. So what it does, it'll actually smooth out your eyebrows. I'll have you pencil them in. If you pencil them in, um, I would just do like the outer side and then I will use a pomade in the end just to get like more um, hair shapes, you know, hair like, you know, I don't have that much hair onto my eyebrows and my eyebrows just to go back to like right here, but I use like, I may go like a little bit like right there just to get, you know, a little bit more shape to my eyebrows. So we were using this pencil. So yeah, let's get started into the product, but I'm looking for one thing. Thing that I'm here it is the concealer that goes um would go underneath my eyebrows that is afterwards so I'm going to use a pencil first but that pencil is not from shop miss a it is from my local it's from my local five below store that I usually go to or onto or at, like not onto but like a walmart you know for 99 cents or like it's under like a dollar you can get about a few of these maybe you can get about five or six i highly recommend this is from wet and wild this is the sema brown in 603a for just under a dollar you can get them at five below or you can get them at walmart it's your choice totally up to you so yeah let's get started into what i do to my eyebrows first oh, this video won't be too long so I just normally take my mirror here so I can see what I'm doing to my eyebrows and just follow me if you like and grab your makeup, uh, your favorite makeup products that you like um, or whichever or just sit back, relax, watch this video with some tea, coffee if you want. You just had a long day at work and I completely understand so, so did I. I had a very long day today but thank God we made it through the day and yes. So let's get into the video. So I just take this pencil and I just go on the outer to, to get the shape of my eyebrows just like this and just like that. I start off just like that so I can get it shaped and then I continue to go on. And having a um, having a mirror is a very good guide too as well. So you can basically see what you're doing. And I just go about like right there. So you can go from here. This is number tip one, tip two, and then tip three. So you can go from one, two to three, and that is about it. I don't really go too far because if I go too far, it'll be weird. So I just go, I stopped about like right there at the end. And then I do my top as well. And what I do to my top is I don't go too far to go like above like right there that's just how i do it i'm just showing you just for that example of how i do it but i hope you're all looking at me to see how i do my eyebrows you can follow along with your favorite eyebrow stuff that you use and i go along about right there and then i take this just a little bit just go along right here to get its thickness i stop and then i use the pomade so then I do the next eye so I can get have this already done. So then that way, you know, I can do the same thing. I normally start from the bottom or I do my top and then I start from the, bo from the bottom. But I normally go with my bottom so that way I can, you know, get its guide and see how I'm doing. I go about like right here with the bottom. I just go real, really light, take my time with this eye because this eye is good. But sometimes it switches like this eye do good, this eye won't, and this eye do good, and this eye won't. So, you know, but you just follow the shape of your own eyebrows of how they are. About like right there is good because that's the same how I have it on this eye. Then I go for my top.
and that is it for my eyebrows just on the outside yes that looks very very good and like a natural so I'm gonna put this down for a second and but sometimes I do go back and forth with just filling in my eyebrows with this wet and wild pencil from um, from Walmart or from five below so that's what I do sometimes but I go back and forth with using just that the pencil by itself or I go with a pomade so I'm gonna go with a pomade again so the way you can see how it looks and I some like I said I sometimes do go back and forth with the pomade and also if your um, pomade gets like a little like dry definitely use some it's like some oil any like oil that you have and then it'll get back to being soft and it'll go back to its to how it was you know when you bought it so I take about like that much just to start off with like about actually that much and then I take my mirror again you can use any mirror that you have into your your to your beauty room or in your, um, your makeup room at all period and just fill it in like so So, and that's how I normally have my eyebrows. But to each person has its um has its own way how to do your eyebrows. You could definitely go up to get the hair like if you want, or you can just go straight across. You know, which is totally easiest for you. You do what's best for you for your eyebrows, for how your eyebrow shape. Because each woman has different eyebrow shapes. You know, because our our all our women's eyebrows are not shaped the same. You know, so go in with your eye brow pomade product you can definitely get the pomade like from makeup revolution that's from you know an Ulta um, beauty store you can go to walmart you can go to target and get any pomade that you like or that's your choice for you and that you've been using for quite some time like maybe let's say three months six months or even a year you know or you can just definitely use a whole entire entire pencil you know which is easiest for you but I thought I'd try something different and that I haven't used in a while so I definitely want to try because what pomade do, does is give you like its natural shape like you know so I just want to try something different onto my video and so yeah that's one and then we'll do the other one so yeah so tell me how was your how was you all day today did you have a good day oh, i pray that you did and i hope the kids had a good day in school today summer school or went back to school already or going back to school next week because some kids that i know that comes in my store they have school this month and i'm like wow for back to going back to school i thought it started in september and like some kids go back, go back this month i'm like woo, woo boy wow I want to just check too also as well to see how your eyebrows are to see how you like the pomade you can also you know get into some more eyebrows if you want to shape them up really good but for here it looks good to me they look the same so I'm gonna not use this anymore because I'm done using this so yep that is a done product for right now I'm just putting it over here on the side so I don't have to keep using that anymore but if I need to get into there then I totally will so I'm going to also put that down for just a moment so now we're going to get into another round brush which is from Shop Miss A which is this right here case it comes wrapped up like this and it's in all black and this is also by AOA Studio <clears throat> excuse me and then this brush set 
excuse me, is $10.55. And I love the brush set because this is super nice. You have your eyes brushes right here, and then you have for your face, which is on the right hand side of me. So this is your left and this is your right. So I definitely love this. You can also travel with this too as well. If you're going traveling anywhere anytime soon or anything like that. So I'm going to take the let's see, this is the flat this flat. Yes, you know what? I'm gonna use another brush that I have from Shop Mistake because I can't find a brush that I really, really want right now. Not that one. Yep, here it is right here this is the aoa studio e122 brush right here this is like a rounded flat brush so i when i do my concealer i normally just go like that and then you know down a little bit and i do the same thing to the top i just go like this to the top so we're going to use this brush for my eyebrows so this is number e122 this is for your eyes and also with Shopman A brushes, they have it for eyes or for your face for a dollar each. If you want to build up your makeup brushes, you can. It's very affordable. I love getting the case with the brushes because that way I don't have to buy each brush individually for a dollar each. But if you want, you can do that. You can also get Urban, it's called Urban Studio brushes from Shopman A, which is like a dollar. You can get like the concealer brush, the contour brush foundation brush so that's a very good buy i'm going to push this in okay so now we're going to go into this this is from um the aoa studio this is pawpaw animal cruelty free which is a dollar and 55 cents and this lasts for 12 months so i'm going to put this a little bit onto the brush which is a clean brush and then after every video too as well i always clean my brushes you know so yes i just squeeze just a tiny bit out and i just go put this a little bit on not too much you know just about that good amount and that'll be good for my left and also for my right but if i need a little bit more to my right i can squeeze it just a little bit more so And also when you're doing your concealer you want to take your time also as well definitely just give yourself light light strokes you know when you do your eyebrows because your eyebrows are definitely your definition to your eyeshadow and a lot of people you know will look at your um, eyes first And then when you get to where you want to, just make sure that you go like this. Just to get that really sharp edge look to the end of your eyebrows. Also want to pull this down with your brush. Just lightly for so. I'm gonna cover that with um, with foundation. So I also want to go like that. So that way that will look really good. What do you all think so far? Oh my goodness! I I normally don't take well when I before I get on to film and we do a video I really take my time with my eyebrows it takes me at least like a half an hour to do my eyebrows and then I'll do a video so yeah I really love how this looks so yes this looks very good it's a very light complexion for my under eyes or my eyebrows I'm gonna do the same thing onto my lips so I used all the products that I have and I need just a tiny bit for my right eye so yes, definitely give this video a like, comment, comment down below, and also share this video with your family and friends. Tell them it's a YouTube channel I hear called The Beauty Room. Yes, I do all makeup tutorials, makeup reviews, 
makeup hauls and clothing hauls so yes definitely give this video a thumbs up and if you subscribe god bless you welcome to the beauty room god bless you and i hope you had a great day for new subscribers and the old subscribers of course from the baby room that's been that's been in my life with video for the longest and i thank you all so much for who you are and what you are supporting and showing your love and um giving my videos a like and yeah and continue letting this channel grow we're going together this channel will be successful i know it will be because by the god by the grace of god jesus christ and his mercy he i mean he is he is showing out and doing his thing with my with my youtube channel and i pray and hope that i am inspiring someone out there and i hope i am because i'm just such a positive person because we got to pray for one another be there for one another as much as we can because you know when you're a youtuber and you're really up there you can't forget about who had brought you to you know up to that level because i won't when i be successful me, me blessed like that i will never forget you all you all be with me from this from the beginning until the end very end so you know i will never forget you all and you're all gonna be coming with me with this journey so god bless you welcome to the beauty room and let's get back into the eyebrow so I do the same thing as I did to my left. This is how much product that I have. I'm going to show you the product. This is about how much I have on there. Just a very little bit because I don't need a whole lot of this product on here. Concealer. This is the HD concealer. I'm sorry. This is the HD concealer. And this is just the um, Pop Off Animal Cruelty Concealer. And this is the liquid concealer. So... I think it does its both job, but with the HD, it gives you that flawless type of look concealer, you know. And again, I just take very little and I just follow my eyebrow shape, uh, you know, so that way I won't, you know, mess up. But, it, but if you do mess up and this is your first time ever doing your eyebrows, try 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 again do not give up you will succeed at getting your eyebrows however you want you know because you know the the look that you want you know so and i just go about like right there just about like right there then i pull it down some just a tiny bit So, yep, that is my eyebrows. What do you all think? <laughs> then I do the same thing to my top, but I normally will have a wipe. I normally have my wipe, but these are the wipes that I use also from Clean and Clear products, which I love me some Clean, clean and Clear, clean and clear um, products, beauty products, which is very affordable. You know, so this... I want to say it was like between four to like eight dollars at my local Walmart that I shop at once or twice or three times out of the month. And yes, I really love this product. This is the Lemon Cleansing Wipes Refreshing Lifts Away Any Makeup and Dirt. And it's oil free. It also plus it has vitamin C. So these are very good. If you can find these at your local Walmart, definitely I highly re highly definitely recommend that you pick these up you know first start off with the first pack and then if you like them um definitely pick another pack you know because these are almost gone so i've been using these quite some time now and what you do is if you want to keep the once they like the access of what uh the water not water but you know the access of it is in here make sure your wipes are flat like this you don't want to have them flat because then you know all that access of what's in the wipes will completely dry out so you want to have them just like this lay them to a container that's like this you can also get these containers too at your local walmart for under two dollars so i love i love these containers so much because you can put so much in here you can use them for your office you can use them for your kids room if you like or, or you know if you have your own office you know mom and dad you can definitely use it for that or you know if you have like an art studio or anything like that you know you can use them for your for your art studio brushes you know, you can use them for all kinds of things, you know, like just if you 
have you know if you want to use it for like your skincare morning and night routine you can try to make your own divider so that way you'll know okay this is my night back here and this is my day in the morning you know so when you wake up before you know after you wake up and things like that have your own have your own routine because i say time and time again how how i have my routine is when I, after i wake up i do pray you know and then i read about a scripture or two in my bible and then i read a woman inspiration you know positivity to keep me positive throughout the whole day and yes that's just what i do in the morning and then i get myself ready to take a shower get myself clothed you know things like that i make breakfast or i go out and get breakfast uh hamilton and i have the same day off i go get breakfast or he'll get breakfast and then i clean up the you know our home for you know for the whole entire day and yeah you know that's just our routine together when we have the same day off so yep so i'm basically done with this product from the aoa studio from shop miss a that is done so then i go into this concealer i matches my that matches my forehead my not my, not my forehead but my skin so you want to find a concealer that matches your skin tone to your face and then you want to have a concealer for underneath your eyebrows for a lighter shade. So yeah. So you always want to go for a lighter shade. Then what I do is with this, I just take the brush and put it onto my upper eyebrows. That's how I do it. I do very, very tiny, but not that much. Let's go like that. There. Just as a start, just as a guide. Let's see how I'm doing it right now. I think I am. Let's see. And then what I'm doing is I'm just doing it like light strokes. I'm brushing it away. I'm not going a straight line. But first what I do is I just brush it away like that. And then I take whatever, whatever product is on my top of my eyebrow. And then I bring it down. So like this. But you do your eyebrows your own way, you know, so that way you can get a feel of how you like your eyebrows. But, you know, nobody's perfect. But if you mess up, you can definitely start over and do it all over again, you know, with the product, which is your favorite products that you use, you know, for your eyebrows. But this is just how I'm showing you what I do when I don't film or when I do film. You know, I, I definitely use these products for sure. This is like in my daily eyebrow routine. And I have a few videos that I've done with other products before I knew about Shop Miss A. Kind of knew about it, but not much, not very. But yeah, I do have videos uh, where I, you know, I use certain products before Shop Miss A um, came about in my life. My in my life yes so i take the same brush from the product i don't i use this but i use this first take a very very tiny bit and that's how i just do it it's very little okay i just take that much because i don't want too much product on to my forehead because i use this product also onto underneath my my eyes because see i have dark circles which is right here also it's another concealer too that don't crease much and it's, it's uh from ColourPop. you can check color color pop out as well and like i said i just do light strokes this is how you just do it just do very very light strokes see just like that Then you take whatever else is left, you just go like that. Mm -hmm. Voila! So, your 
eyebrows are done. So I'm definitely done with using this brush also as well. So then we're going to take a spoolie. Oh, spoolie, do I have one in here? Nope, I do not. Let's see if I have a spoolie. Yes, I do. I had all these products out the other night. <laughs> I'm going to do this video. Okay. So, this is just, this is just a product um, spoolie that you can definitely have. You can definitely get them from Shop Miss A. You can get them from, from Sheen. And this is just a spoolie. Just by itself. It's no comb at the end. It's just a spoolie. So, I highly recommend that you get several of these spoolies. So that way, when you do your eyebrows, you can definitely just use the product that you have on your front eyebrow and just brush the product in. So that's how you can get like a nice type of natural, you know, look that you want. Definitely take your mirror, but I just wanted to show you first um, how I do my, uh, my eyebrows. And wow, they look really, really good okay <laughs> thank you makeup gods <laughs> and then you just take the brush that's just like this take very very little and just take your time with doing your eyebrows because your eyebrows are your definition of your look you know what i mean so and if you want that faded look you can go like a little bit more but this is good enough for me so I mean, wow, they look really good. What you all think? Did I, did I do a good job? If I, did a, if I did a good job with my eyebrows, definitely give it a like, comment, and subscribe to the YouTube room if I did good. <laughs> and yeah, um, I just want to say thank you all so much before I get started with some more products. I just want to send this message out to you all wonderful subscribers, new and the OGs. God bless you all. Thank you so much for supporting me. And like I said, loving me for who I am and what I am on my YouTube channel. When you do subscribe to my channel, you are supporting me with, with YouTube. Thank you all so, so much. It really means a lot to me from my heart. God bless you. I pray for each and every one of you, your loved ones, your children, yourselves. I pray for you all. I pray for us all to get um to definitely support one another and just stay healthy and stay safe and children may you have a blessed and wonderful year this year this school year just please be safe and listen to your teachers listen to your assistant teachers and just be careful and pay attention be good in class and when you get out of school please be good get home safely when you're on the school bus you know definitely Listen to the school driver and to the school, um, the bus driver aide as well, because he or she, you know, are not trying to be your boss or your parents, but they just want you all to be safe before you get home. So definitely have a blessed and wonderful school year. Please be safe. Um, I pray for you students as well. All of you, all whatever grades that you are in going back to school or starting a new year off with a different school different teachers you know different home schools and different things like that and i pray for the teachers and principals you know i pray for each and every person that are giving these children education may they be safe as well and yeah and i will be praying for y'all to not get bullied i hope not you know because you got kids out there you know i i don't know but you know i do pray for them as well so yes Let's get back into the video, but I do and pray that you all have a blessed and healthy, safe school year, okay? Please listen to your teachers, assistant teachers, the principal. Listen to your counselor, you know, your guidance counselor. Um, please be good in class, in the classroom, and pay attention because the education is very important to you as you're growing up, you know, to be an adult. So someday and one day when you get married and be blessed with your own children, you know, yes you want the same thing for them okay let's get back to the video all right so i did my eyebrows i'm done with that and i will take this in the beginning of the video some more of what that but first i'm going to take this brightening cream you can use this in the daytime 
also at night with your skin care routine in the morning and also at night you can definitely use that you know with your skincare routine and this is a dollar from shop miss a and you just take just a fingertip just put very little you just go underneath your eyes and just put it on like about like that much I don't use a whole whole lot you know and then I just let it sit right there for just a minute while I'll get other products out about that much you want to use and this does last for about six months so if you run out within the fourth month you can definitely you know order from shopmas again because it's very affordable it's only a dollar and if you don't want shopmas a pop beauty products you know stuff like this um you can definitely go to your local ulta beauty beauty store and get i think it's called origins origins or something like that it's an orange and white um container and that does you know give your skin a good cleanse um it brightens your skin and it also um make dark circles and um if you have this color this col coloration like i do sometimes but like not this coloration i have dark spots as you can tell so i want to definitely get rid of these for my skin to be a lot more you know i mean it's pretty you know i'm blessed with my skin but you know there's sometimes i want that flawless look you know when hamilton and i go on a special date night but you know he accepts me he accepts me for who I am and what I am and I accept him for who he is and what he is on the inside and outside because I definitely love him so very so very much and yes yeah, so that was just that and then I go into the serum so you want to use this and this together you know so I'm gonna use very little not too much because I have a primer that I want to use and this was also a dollar too from shop miss a and it's just like a drop so you want to shake it for just a, a few a few seconds or so and this also lasts for about six months also and you want to just apply it you know like right here and here and here let me see the product because it's there you go And that's just how I just use it as just a very little. And this is a serum too. This one has, it's by Global Beauty Care Multivitamins Serum with vitamin B, C, and E. And it also it's a serum. It has vitamins B, C, and E also as well. So I'm just letting you know. And if you didn't hear me, I'm just put it all right here. Because I do have large pores. I like to just put it like right above there and sometimes I like to put it right underneath my cheeks and also right here right on my nose I do have large pores like right there so that is it for that one and then now this is from of course AOA studio and this is the clean slate face primer this is in a 0.67 fluid ounce. This was just like a dollar to a dollar fifty-five or a dollar eighty-eight. And this also lasts for 12 months. This is the AOA number 3044. And I use about gotta shake it up first. Sorry, I forgot to tell you that. Shake up your primer. I use about like that much. I don't use a whole lot because with the primer, you know, you want to just Dot it on just like that. And if you have extra, this is what I do. And this is a very good smelling primer. Yeah, it does smell good. Spell it one more time. Yes. It has like a light scent smell to me. Maybe it, or maybe not. It's probably just my nose. I've been smelling a lot of stuff all day today at work. And I just put it above my forehead. I just go like that. I like to just put this stuff on my face before I apply my foundation because I want to get to my eyes and now. So we're gonna get to that. I just like to do that first. That's just what I like to do. That's just me. 
I don't start off. I start off with my eyebrows and then go to my eyes. But I like to start with my face. So that stuff can be already set it, set it in already. Settle into my skin. So that way I don't have to, you know, put all that on. And then, you know. I, I mean, sometimes I do stuff backwards. But, you know, there's no rules to makeup. You can apply your makeup however you like. You know, but if you like how other YouTube, you know, famous um, women do their YouTube channel, you can follow them. Or if you have your own thing, you know, in mind of how you like to do your own makeup routine, definitely do it because, you know, we all as women, you know, have our own, you know, our own unique way of how to apply our, our makeup. So this is what I got just about a week and a half ago almost two weeks this is the new nine color eyeshadow palette by cherry blossom and this name is called h-i-m-e-j-i -E i'm not gonna say the word i just rather say it and this was about a dollar to a dollar 88 and this lasts about 12 months so we're going to apply the first shade which is this shade right here it has no name, so I'm going to apply this shade and then this shade, as a, you know, so. And I'm going to apply a glitter, and then that's it for that one. So I'm going to go into, into this. Actually, I'm going to take this plastic off and just throw it away. This is just the AOA Studio brush in E139. So this is like a flat, rounded brush. So yes, I'm going to... This shade right here. And I'm going to take my mirror and tap, tap, tap. Then you want to just apply this. It does not look bad onto my skin, you know, because there's some shades for my skin tone. If you're in my skin tone, will work for you, but you have to use a really, really good eye primer. So I didn't put any eye primer onto my eyes. I just want to see how these look without the eye primer. And then I'll go back again to the same shadow palette, and then I'll see how it looks with primer. But I just want to see how it looks without but so far, without the primer, it does not look bad at all. It looks pretty good, so I cannot complain right now. It looks very, very good. So now we're going to go into that other shade, that orangey, darker shade, which is this shade, oops, which is right here, this one right here. I'm going to go into that. You want to get a good amount. And then just apply it just like right here. And then you want to apply it onto the other corner. Can you see it? But yeah, I think you need like a um, like a uh, an eye primer. Can I talk? So then I'm going to take this shade right here, but I'm gonna use my fingers because they say when you um, apply these kind of shimmers you want to use your fingers which is best just to get that look that you want wow okay so then if you want to mix in like in another shimmer you can I'm going to mix it in with this um with this white one which is right here but I'm yeah I'm gonna use the white one because I want to see how they both look you know I, I'm just testing out this palette here to see how the shades really are and yeah so far not bad but you definitely want to use a primer wow okay does not look bad at all so you definitely want to use a, a primer when you have these type of um, this type of palette, you definitely want to use a uh, a eye a eye 
primer for your lid. But so far, not too bad. You know, because with my skin tone, it don't, it don't look bad with this um, with this dress too. It matches the kind of it matches the dress a little bit. So I'm gonna show you the palette. So far, I wish I use this shade right here, and then I use this shade here. It looks really good so far. I could not complain. So I'm going to go into the other eye and do the other eye. I know this video is like a forever video, but I just wanted to talk to the kids for just a minute just to bless them to have a blessed new year in school and just obey your teachers definitely obey your parents you know make and make sure your homework is done too <laughs> not in classroom make sure your homework is done at home <laughs> so yeah but definitely have a blessed one for school your kids okay Okay, wow, that shade does not look bad on me at all because I like it. It gives me like that type of neutral, type of light peach, both shade to me. So now we're going to go into that darker orange, which is right here. I'm going to do the front and then the back corner. hoping you can see this a little bit <laughs> and I'm using this wipe which is right here next to me so I'm gonna take my finger yeah take my finger and I'm going to apply that goldish shade that I used and then I'm gonna take that white as well I need to apply some lashes, you all. Oh my goodness. This look is look look looks this look looks so pretty with lashes. Yeah. OMG. Okay, just about like a good amount, you know. I don't like to put a whole lot onto my lid. Yeah. Okay. Then I'm going to apply the other one same finger that I used which is this one right here wow that looks so pretty I'm gonna apply a little bit more onto this side to this eye okay there we go yes okay so now I'm just going to take a different shade and put it up my, um, under my brow. So just like a really golden bronzy type of shade. Just go like about right here. I don't put a whole lot on. About like that much. Then I'm going to apply it to, to my inner corner, but that's when I'm done applying my makeup because I don't want to put it on now. So that way, yeah, so far, so good. So that way, it won't mess up my foundation. Now, this is a foundation brush. I got this from Sheen. Not Sheen, but Sheen. Um, it's called the Mange 5996. This was under six under $6.00. So if you do not have a flat kabuki round brush like this for your foundation, definitely get it at um, Shop Miss A has it. Um, and Sheen www.shein.com. Shop Miss A is www.shopshopmiss8.com. Shop 
time and get your makeup brushes from there which is a dollar each and up and then also if you want excuse me if you want to get the like get the pack with the makeup brushes definitely definitely get them so i'm gonna tell you the products that i use and what i loved and what i didn't like and it was okay so i'm just going to apply my product you know what actually i'm not gonna put the brush i'm going to apply it to my forehead just like that this is from the shop miss a a studio oh my goodness not get help there we go okay so that's all i really use i don't use a whole lot but um, you want to shake it well before you put, put it onto your face make sure it's in a warm, um, warm room temperature for your foundations this is the pro wear foundation full coverage this is in a one fluid ounce and this is in 0380 cappuccino if you're in my shade and the concealer from aoa studio with the pawpaw um this is in the nutmeg which is about like a dollar 55 to a dollar 88 so i'll tell you about that product as well and what i just do i just blend this out like this You also want to make sure it's to your neck, your foundation. also want to check yourself too with your mirror to make sure that you got everything of how you want it blended and make sure it's really blended really really good with your foundation to make sure you see. this is just how I do it because uh, I don't have that much hair so I make sure that it's blended in with my skin let's go like that like that and this is a very very good um, foundation. Really do like it. Make sure you get your nose really, really good to mix in with the foundation. And this really does give you full coverage foundation with shop miss a aua studio I, re I really do like this foundation it gives you really good full coverage but there's other foundations too that will get you full coverage but if you're a beginner in makeup and you this is like your first or second time of buying your makeup and you really can't afford are you trying to save save up the money for your makeup which the ones you really really want I would definitely go with Shop Miss A because it's not bad at all. Some products are good, some products are not. That's just my honest goodness opinion. So I want to make sure you blended this very, very well, very good for just a few minutes. And I think I got it all. So now we're going to apply the concealer. This is the HD concealer. This one is in Espresso, which is 2324. And what I do is I just put it just above, like, right here. here. Okay, like that. And just right there. That's just what I do. And I use the same brush that I use my foundation on and 
You can also definitely get a concealer that's like a little lighter to your skin tone. And that way, if you're in my shade, you can definitely get that. Or if you're lighter than me, you can go with a, like a lighter shade of concealer. Definitely, definitely you can do that. Sorry, don't you think I was flicking y'all off because I'm out. Sorry. So yes, that is good to me. What do y'all think? <laughs> Hope you like this video, giving it a thumbs up, like, comment, subscribe. Please tell your family and friends it's about a YouTube channel out here called The Beauty Room. Yes, I love makeup like the next woman and that's, I have a passion for it. I love makeup. I love applying makeup because I feel like such, you know, a mature woman, you know, that's using these good products, which I love, affordable, you know. And yes, next we're going to apply this AOA Studio Perfect Finishing Press Powder. And that will go around to my face right here. And we're going to use... This one is the AOA Studio F23. And this is are from this is the brush guide. You know, you can definitely um, get these also from Shein, which is like between like a dollar fifty to like three dollars. I'm really not for sure. You can definitely make sure that you definitely get these type of garters to put your makeup back in shape after you're done cleaning your makeup brushes. And I will also show you too that routine of how I clean my makeup brushes as well in the next coming up future video and I just want to say to you all thank you so so much for giving my videos that I've done recently so far I have a really good like and um, commenting on them and I reply to you all back as much as I can because you know I'm definitely at work but yes I really love to see you all comments and just now subscribing to the beauty room and I love it because it gets it gets my day a blissful day and like I said I hope and pray that I am inspiring someone out here in the YouTube um in the YouTube and you know hopefully making their dreams come true you know not to be shy you know you can do it if I can do it you can dream it and do it as well even if it's not YouTube or you want to be on YouTube, but you want to have a different type of channel, like a cooking channel, just a cookie channel, a baking channel. And, you know, that would be awesome, too, because, you know, I'm a person that will give you support, you know, throughout your video, first video, or more videos that you do. I definitely will give you support, you know. And I'm not the type of person, you know, to just not watch your video. I love watching videos of cooking and you know makeup of course <laughs> and just loving all kinds of things like the next woman does in life so yeah even though i didn't put no concealer here i just like to give that a good brushing and yeah and i only use one brush so far from this set but i will use more when i do another um type of video but yeah, that is it. I kind of like it how this looks. And this is very good too. This was just like $1.55 and up. Probably like almost like $2. And that is it for that brush. And the next product is... Now this is the bronzer and highlighter and blush. This is the new product that I got also within a week and a half. This is in Sunkissed Trio Bronzer. This is in number one. It's called Indulgence, and that's what it is. So we're going to apply that as well. We're going to use that brush that I just used for like my bronzer, like finishing powder. So we're going to use this. We're going to use both of these, like right here. Well, I guess I guess a very good bronzer too, and a highlighter. Oh yes, 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 yes. Ooh, give my nose a glow. I like that. <laughs> yeah, so if you definitely um like highlighter and bronzer like I do, 
I love it. I don't put too much. I try not to put too much, you know, onto my face. You know, because I like to have my face looking natural as possible. But, yeah, that don't, oh, I just bend that into my, oh my gosh, that's okay. But, yeah, I'm going to just apply a little bit of this right here. Okay. Yep. Ooh, that's good. Okay. And now the blush. I normally don't use a, like a lot of blush because I'm not that blush type of person. But I like to just try different new things because you know you're supposed to do that in life. You're supposed to try different things. Yeah. Well, that's cute. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, this was like about a dollar to a dollar eighty eight. This is about like a dollar from Shop Miss Egg, which I mean the highlighter. Let me just show you the highlighter. Like wow. Look at that. That's just the highlighter and I'm gonna show you the blush. Wow. That's the blush, and then let me show you the bronzer. That's the bronzer. wow very very pretty i definitely highly recommend that you get that so now we're going to apply the last thing is to my brows which is the brow gel from shop is a which is just the click top coat new look clear defying no this is not from shop miss a this is from sheen for just like a dollar to like almost three dollars this is from Sheen. So this is called Sheet Makeup. It's either from Shop Miss A or Sheen. But you can definitely check one of those out. And get their products. You know, a, cl a clear mascara gel. But I believe it's on top of my head. I believe it's from Shop Miss A. This product. This is called the Sheet Makeup. Which is just a dollar. For this, um, for this brow gel. Mascara brow gel. I wanted to open up the products with you all so you can see the products. And I'm going to see the packaging and then see the products. And it's just a clear. I can get it out. It does not really want to come out. second let's try to get this out there you go out. <laughs> wow <laughs> okay so you want to just go like this set this down and then you want to use your mirror and this is just like a brow clear gel and so that way when you're done with your makeup it will make your lashes i mean your lashes your eyebrows last throughout the whole entire day and night but you may need to do like a little bit of tiny more touch up you can definitely put this in your cute um crossbody purse you know that matches your outfit or a black one or a white one you know that will look super cute with your outfit that's what i love to do match my purse you know with um with what i'm wearing that's just me. That's just how I was taught when I was um, when I was little, growing up. To always match what you are wearing, you know, with your uh, with your outfit. Always got to match from head to toe, <laughs> even with your shoes. <laughs> yes, I mean that's just that's just me. That's just how I was taught. So, you know, I want to teach Hamilton Ice kids when we adopt to teach my girls the same way as well. To always match from head to toe. Because they're going to be super cute and look cute like their mom. Oh, yes. So, okay. Um, I believe I'm done. I just got to put some mascara on. And lipstick. Oh, yes. Girl, I got to put on some lipstick. And the products I want to use. This is from Shop Miss A. I'm using all Shop Miss A products. 
This is from Shop Miss A. This is the Spider Lash Mascara Volume Extreme Impact Mascara, which is about a dollar. So I really like this mascara because you have this side if you want. You also have this side, you know, for your upper lower. But I'm going to use this side for my upper and bottom. So. And before you also apply, you want to make sure that you use an eyelash curler to curl your, your lashes first. And then you want to put an eyelash primer on so that way when you apply your mascara, it'll give you that volume that you want. But, you know, I just want to just put on the mascara and that's it. This look looks so pretty with some um, falsies. <laughs> I'm not that good with falsies yet, you all, you know that, but I, I'm, I'm going to be trying this year. I just got a lot going on this month. Um, it's Hamilton I wedding coming up this month. We're blessed and excited. Yeah, definitely. I'm so happy to be marrying my best friend, my soulmate, my everything, you know. It's a blessing. <laughs> so, what do you think? Ooh, wow, it really came out nice. Because now with this eye, I sometimes got to use the other end of this mascara because this eye is like a, I don't know, it's weird. But when I look in the mirror, it's like, oh, okay, I have, you know, I'm, you know, wearing some mascara. But then, like, when I'm on video, it don't look like it on this side on this eye but when I'm done filming and everything I'm like oh wow okay <laughs> and then when you um, apply your lash you want to just apply a, a couple of coats of your favorite mascara or your mascara that you want and they also have a new mascara from Maybelline New York this thing is called the X X exhibition or something like that with the strength and valuing it's an all black I think it's like an orange um, type of stripe or black and like a light tan or something like that so I really really want to check that out and get that so I can do a test you know with the all and review let's see that mascara because I like to have I don't like to have a whole lot of mascaras because after a while they get dry out and you kind of wasted your money that's why I just go for Shop Miss A's mascaras or Dollar Tree mascaras because I know I can use them up really, really quick within one to three months and then throw them away and get it again like that. But sometimes I do like to um, definitely try to use drugstore mascaras. Okay, yes, that is done. Wow. All right. So now we're going to try the last thing and last thing only. This is the AOA Studio. I've seen it all day, so please excuse me if I said it a billion times in this video. Now you know it's from Shop Miss A by AOA Studio, and that means to tell you to go to Shop Miss A. After you're done watching this video, go on to shopmissa.com right now. Or after you're done watching this video, grab whatever you want, put it into your cart. You can go up to $35 if you want or a little over. You can go up to $100 if you want. It's totally up to you. However you want to spend your money, it's your money. And yes, and definitely get these. These are the Creamy, Rich and Creamy Velvet Color Charity Edition, which is $1.55. So your change will go to a charity. And then also, it's an Ultra Pigment matte lip and this is the velvet lips this is in Reese. so don't need that no more trash okay so and you can also pop this too with some lip gloss if you want 
totally up to you. This is a brand new lip color. Now it's out of the package. So now this number is 0410 Reese R E E S E. I'm going to apply it to my hand so you can see how it looks. Very pretty. Love that look. It goes good with the dress. Yes, it does. Mm, you also want to make sure your lips are uh, clean. Ooh, this is pretty. Okay, so final thoughts taking this off of my head. Oh, yeah. So, taking my hair down. Yes, I'm going to be redoing my hair before the wedding or getting a different hairstyle. However, I'm going to do it. I just don't quite know. That's from just the spa the spa um headband that i use so yes this is the finished look what do you think i hope you liked it so let's go over to the products that i used and yes my final thoughts in my own opinion was within these products that i use so this is um number two that i've used all shop miss a products nothing else of all shop miss a so the first thing I want to talk about is this mirror. This is a good handheld mirror. This is it's very like light to me, so you can definitely use this on you know for your makeup, for your eyebrows. This is a multi-use mirror. I really love it, and it's pink, light pink, which I love pink. I'm a pink woman. I've been wearing pink since I was one, so and I knew that was gonna be my color for the rest of my life. So, yes, yeah, so I really do love pink. It's my favorite color in the whole wide world. Please excuse my hair. <laughs> but, anywho, so, um, yes, I definitely love this mirror. So, yeah, I love it. It's just like a dollar fifty-five to a dollar eighty-eight. You can definitely get a few of these. You can get about five to six of these if you want to have a girls' day and um, spa day. You know, um, you ladies um, enjoy putting on your makeup favorite makeups if you want and using this mirror to really get the entice look of you know what look that you love you know after you're done applying your makeup this is a definitely good product this is a must have into your shop miss a cart which i love so i have about um i think two of these so that's good enough for me and then they also have like a small black one as well which is like a dollar um, that one's a dollar but it's much smaller that one just say AOA Studio and you know it can get like your eyebrows or if you want to apply some lashes to your look when you're done applying your look you can definitely use that smaller brush you have to look down kind of not all the way down but look down like that and just you know make sure you are putting your eyelashes onto your eyelid you know to your eyeline lid yep, so this is a definitely must have okay so now as I told you about this this is super cute and it pulls all your hair back i really like this spa headband which is just a dollar from shop miss a or from sheen 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 i'm sorry not sheen sheen you can definitely get that on www.shein.com or www.shopmissa dot com get that from there or you can go to your local five below or online which is www dot five f i v e b e l o w dot com and spend whatever amount you want but it'll cost eight dollars well seven ninety five I just round up to eight dollars for shipping for free shipping so that's a very good deal and then I have not used this product yet but this is a very good product so this is a AOA Studio Mascara Guard this goes for your top mascara and then your bottom 
this right here so that way you can get that precise value onto your onto your your own eyelashes however you want very good thing to have a must have into your makeup starter kit or to your makeup collection which is just a dollar i really like this and i use this quite some time like a few times from from shop miss a i really do like it because it lasts for about six months you can get a couple of these you know maybe four to five maybe you know about that many if you want so that way you can have a backup of a backup of a backup of so this mascara clear gel for your eyebrows as you can tell it looks really good and my eyebrows are dry and they're not going anywhere i love that and then this is the clean slate face primer it was it went on very smoothly i really liked it. i let it sit on before i apply my makeup like my foundation and my concealer my foundation and concealer excuse me i really really do like this was about a, between a dollar 55 to a dollar 88 and what it does is clean slate is a lightweight and melts right into your skin leaving it silky smooth while ex extending makeup wear so that's what it does so yes that's what i did that's what i like to do sometimes or i change it up you know every now and then but i like to put the face primer on first and then you know go into my eye you know after my eyebrows my face primers or prime face primer you know um if you you know want to look that snatched definitely yes for this a uh, you know a few bucks this is very good to have look, a good quality i really do like it and this is last up to 12 months so i like that and then this um global beauty care um serum it does really good it's i mean i like it there's no complaints about it and it's not tested on animals it's for all skin types and it's have all the pH balance in it and it has no S S L S S L E S and I like that and it has everything else that's a no on not blind you uh, it has no there on top of there and then it has what it does you know um to let you know what it does and it also does the serum is formulated to smooth heal and rejuvenate the skin use morning or night for night best results Vi vitamin b helps reduce redness and uneven skin tone vitamin c promotes brighter more radiant skin vitamin e helps replenish the skin's natural oils that promote anti-aging so i use this before i apply my makeup or if you want to put this into your skin routine in the morning and night you definitely can do that for just a dollar to a dollar Five. I believe it's a dollar or shop miss a very good products and this concealer which is a very good one this is in my shade this is a nutmeg I really do like this it lasts for 12 months and as you see onto my under eyes how it was before and this is the after which I really like it don't have that much creasing as you can see not bad at all this is a very good product to have into your makeup love that and then this is the perfect finishing Press powder. This is in 161 Cafe. So it's 161 dash C A F E. I really like this product. It does last for 12 months also as well. And it's at no animal cruelty free. So it's not tested on animals. I like that. It's a very good finishing, like natural product. It's really looking really good on my skin. I do like it for between a dollar fifty-five to a dollar eighty-eight. And also with the mascara. This you can use as number one here. You can use number two, whichever is your choice or dollar. This is the Spider Lash Mascara Volume Extreme Impact Mascara for this a dollar. And it's an also in black. So you can use either or. I like that. And definitely I love the lip mattes. This is the AOA Studio Velvet Lip in what did I say? 0410 Reese. Yep, you can put lip gloss on this if you want to get that glossy look. But the matte look looks really good to me. I do like that for a dollar fifty-five. And then this was like a dollar. This is their new nine color eyeshadow palette, which I really do love. As you can tell, very very good. As you can see, the these are the bron the, the highlight, the bronzer, the blush to that blush product that I showed you. And then these are it, the lip. And the uh, the bronzer from the bronzer blush trio number one indulge 
but this is really really good i do like it because i'm i just started using it so it looks really good so far so i do like it and the eyebrow pomade wonder brow tinted brow which it looks really really good on my brows i did such a fabulous job on my eyebrows i never do this good to my eyebrows you know i love it for just a dollar highly recommend that you get this also as well definitely get this case to the shopmas a brushes i use quite a few of them not too much but i'm gonna use this brush set again when i do a shopmas a makeup tutorial review slash review or just use these brush period when i have something else to do a makeup tutorial and you know my fave fat favorite um eyebrow to use is the wet and wild Seema Brown in 603A from Five Below and also Walmart. Definitely get five or six of these. Put them in your cart when you go into the store of Five Below or Walmart and get these. If they still have these, I believe it's for a dollar or maybe it could be a dollar, a little bit more dollar, but I believe it's still like under a dollar. So definitely get these into your cart when you go to Walmart for, you know, your, your regular shopping. And the brush that I used from that case, which is 1055, I really do like it. It went on very, very well. I really liked how I did this look. It looks really, really good. And yes, and this brush from the case again, the flat kabuki brush, which I used it for a highlighter, bronzer, and blush. I really, really do like this look. This look came out so, so beautiful. If you're just going somewhere or going to the store, you know, you want just like a little bit of makeup on. This look will work if you're going to the grocery store, to just Walmart or something like that. You want to look cute going to Walmart with this type of a dress, you know, tube dress, which is very long. It goes all the way down up to my feet. You can wear with some flat sandals or some or some flat um, flip flaps, you know, some cute flip flop sandals and a cute crossbody. A cute little jean jacket little earrings and necklace or whichever you're good to go with the watch just a little bit you know kind of look cute stylish going to the store you know there's nothing wrong with that and i definitely highly last thing i highly that you recommend that you definitely get these makeup brushes garters for your makeups because after when you're done washing your makeup brushes these stretch too as well as far as you really want them to stretch so but this one don't but i do have some ones from uh, from sheen that does stretch really good you know but no uh, but these came with the case so if you want to get these by itself you can get them at she at sheen which is www.shein.com which is like a dollar fifty to like almost three dollars you get about 50 in a pack so i will get about two packs which is a hundred that way you have them for the whole entire year, you know, because you gotta clean, you have to clean up your makeup brush. You have to. That is definitely a must when you after done applying your makeup and things like that. Or if you're a makeup artist and you are done with your brushes with your clients, you know, you definitely got to keep your brushes clean and sanitized. So, yes, I love this brush. This is from from Machine also as well. I really liked how this brush, you know worked with my foundation i really really like this i highly recommend that you look for this brush um i believe they sell it by itself between like under six dollars or about that much so definitely get about a few of these flat rounded makeup brushes for your foundation you know for your new clients or even for yourself get you a couple for yourself and then get you a couple for your clients that way they have you know their own makeup brushes and yeah that is the, it oh one more thing okay. one one more thing and this is from the wonder cover hd concealer and number 2324 espresso i really liked how it went on not to my under eyes but to my uh over concealer to my eyebrows and i really like how my eyebrows looked i think i did a really good job with my eyebrows what do y'all think? Think I did good? Yeah, but this was really good. So, so definitely give this a try to put this into your cart at shopmissa.com. So, yes, that is the end of this whole hour video. God bless you all and welcome to the video. God bless you all. Thank you so much. 
You all mean the world to me. You are the best people in the whole wide world. God bless you and welcome to the Beauty Room family. You are part of the Beauty Room family. And make sure you turn on that notification bell so you'll know when I upload. You'll never miss a video from the Beauty Room. Me, Don, yes. And yes, um, get, look forward to some new videos, upcoming videos, and future videos from the Beauty Room. But God bless you. Have a beautiful Tuesday evening. And beauty Tuesday evening from the video room. God bless you all. Please stay safe. Dream big. Make sure you, your dreams and goals are met with you and your accomplishments. You got this. You can do this. And if you fall again, pick yourself back up and do it again. Because we all make mistakes. I'm not perfect. Oh, trust me. No. <laughs> but thank you for accepting me. And I love you all so much from my heart to yours. God bless you. Have a truly blessed and wonderful week. God bless you all and stay safe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.